Happy Monday, everyone. I bet you're raring to go, right? Raring to go back to work. In fact, the question is, are you raring to go back to work? Are you one of those people that gets up in the morning and dreads going back to work? Because you don't enjoy your work. And every single Monday morning, or it could be every other day of the week, of your working week, this internal dialogue, this internal negative dialogue goes on in your head. And you're there driving to work, walking to work, and it's still on your mind. And then in the morning, you're still feeling really groggy, you know, not still feeling with it. Because you're not really, really happy about your work. You're not fulfilled with your work. You're really bored. Yet what happens is, right, this happens every single week. Every single week, and you could be in a job for literally years or months, not doing anything about it. So the question is, when are you going to do something about it? If you're not happy with your work, if you're not feeling getting that fulfillment from your work, when are you going to do something different? When are you going to stop procrastinating? When are you going to get up off your ass and do something about it? When are you going to quit complaining? When are you going to quit moaning and get something done about it? So if you're on a work, if you're on a job that you don't enjoy, if you're not getting that fulfillment, you have to take some sort of action. Or it may not necessarily be a job. It may be that you have a side project, a dream project that you've always, always wanted to do. But all it's been is thoughts. All it's been is imagination. It's not been any sort of implementation, no action. It's just been thoughts. So now, now is your time. Now is your time to take that action. The question is, when are you going to do it? When are you going to do it? If you watch this video and you don't do anything about it, please just shut this video up. Because the last thing I want to do is shoot a video and you not doing anything about it. I want you now to think and get that, that thought of when you're going to do it. Of when you're going to do it. Are you going to do it at lunchtime, in your lunchtime? Uh, maybe if it's calling someone or taking a specific course or doing some sort of action or orientated thing that will get you a little bit more closer to what it is that you want to do. Is it going to be in your lunchtime? Is it going to be after work? You need to pick, pick a specific time of when you're going to do this. Because if you keep saying, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, it won't happen. You'll just procrastinate. So what I want you to do, and I want this to be the main drive away message, is for you to take action on finding the work that makes you feel, if it makes you fulfilled. Now, if you don't know what specifically that is, then you still can take action. If you're at a crossroads and you want to get more clearer, then what you need to do is get some sort of coaching. You need to get that sort of clarity. You need to get that focus back. You need to get that motivation back. You need to stop the procrastination. You want to take actions so you can do what you've always loved or find something that you want to, that you that you, that you have an interest in. You need to take some sort of action. So the action needs to be today. And I want you to plant the seed. And I really want you to focus on when you're going to do this. Because all it takes is that small step. It doesn't have to be a huge step. It just has to be a small action that will get you started. Because once you get the motions rolling, once you get that momentum going, then things will be easier. And all it takes is baby steps. You don't want to overwhelm yourself and take massive, you know, like really, really big actions. Because often what happens is that when you when you're doing over drastic things, or when you when you make it much more bigger than 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 what it is, what happens is you end up kind of not only procrastinating, but you you kind of put a barrier in front of yourself. So even if it makes taking a small step and you take a series of those small steps, that will then get you closer to your passion, get you closer to finding work that fulfills you. So please do that right now. Think about when you're going to do this and get it done now. I hope this video has benefited you. Please share this video. video. Please share to anyone else that you know would like this. And I'll speak to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.